to my YouTube channel. I'm Kylie and so today we're going to be doing a pack with me. You guys really requested this on my Instagram poll that I did so here it is. So I'm going to be packing for my Panama Beach trip that's coming up um, literally this weekend on Saturday. We're leaving and we're staying from Saturday to Wednesday. So this is going to be a little prep and prepare video. I'm going to be packing. I'm going to be unboxing a couple stuff. Couple things that I got. I'm also going to be doing my nails and yeah so let's go ahead and get right into the video. So the first thing I'm going to do is a little unboxing. So I just got this package that I ordered from Sephora. Um, so I needed to get a new setting spray. So this is what this is. Alright guys so got it open. Um, so I just got one thing. But I got the Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless Setting Spray. And so I got the mini version because... We're not going to talk about the full size sprays. But this was $24 at Sephora. And I hope it's good because I hear a lot of stuff about this. So cute. Um, so I'm hoping that this is good because recently I've been using my e.l.f. makeup mission set. I'll put a picture of it on the screen. Um, it's not the best because it like... Like punches you on your face? Very light. The mister seems really nice. And hopefully it'll be worth the money that I spent on it. But yeah, so I'll be packing this stuff and lay with me. Okay, so of course I had to make a little pack list. So I'm going to just read over this really quickly. I'll have it on the screen so that you guys can see. Um, but this is a pack this for Panama City Beach. Obviously, I mentioned earlier that we'll be there for four days total. We'll be leaving on Wednesday, um, like coming back to Georgia, but we'll be leaving on Saturday to head up there. So we'll have four full days there. So the first little section I have here is for clothes. So I already kind of laid out all my outfits that I want to bring. So the first one is like, um, I want to bring a tank top and shorts. The second one is like a dress, you know oversized teen shorts oversized teen shorts and then on the way back i'm gonna wear like a crew neck or a hoodie all that jazz you guys can read um next is like shoes so there's not many shoes i'm going to be bringing because i'll probably be wearing flip-flops or sandals or slides or something but i also wanted to make sure that i bring a pair of tennis shoes as well next section i have is like toiletries so first i have my skincare and typically when i travel depending on how long i'm going to be there um, it kind of differs between how much skincare and makeup I bring, but since we're going to be there for like five days, that's pretty much like a whole school week. So I'm going to be bringing most of my um, skincare. So that's my cleanser, eye cream, a moisturizer, um, my eyelash serum, and at least one lip mask or lip scrub. And then as well for makeup, I'm going to bring my Glow Recipe Dew Drops, my Say Glowy Super Gel, a concealer, a blush, a highlighter, a eyeliner two mascaras, um, an eyelash curler, setting spray, Charlotte Tilbury, and then my lip gloss. And then I also have a section called like bathroom essentials, which is like my toothbrush, toothpaste, retainers, um, bonnet, you know, shower cap, all that type of stuff. Um, and then I have my little beach kit down here. Um, it's just like, you know, bathing suits, things that I want to bring to do at the beach. Um, so like a book because I've definitely been getting into reading a little bit more and I'm reading a super great book. I'll put it on the screen. Um, they have three movies and three books. I've already watched the movies and I fell in love with them. So I'm just kind of like off track. So like, um, yeah. Really good and I'm reading the first book right now so I'm definitely going to bring that to the beach. And then like sunscreen and then I kind of put like tanning oil because I don't really know if I'm going to be bringing that or not. And then at the bottom I just have undergarments and... You guys can read you know what those are but yeah that's my like my little packing list um i plan to get most of the <laughs> plan to get to most of this stuff today um but today is currently wednesday it is J july 5th um so i am packing a little bit early but tomorrow i have a hair appointment and then friday is like the day before and i don't i'm not really that type of packer so today is definitely the day to get most of the stuff done so without me talking so much, because I know some people who have short attendance spans like me would have already clicked off of this video, but stay on because we're about to get to all the packing. All right, so this is the luggage I'm gonna be bringing. It's kind of like this small slim, like 
green um luggage that i'm going to be using so this is what we're going to be all right so i just picked out most of the outfits some of them are still like a work in progress because i need to wash some stuff which i'll also do later in this video that i want to pack but i'll go over what i have so far and i'll try to tell you where everything is from so first is this like tangerine kind of like tank and out in the back if you guys remember from my spring break vlog i'll link it down below in the description um i bought this this is from old navy and i just think it's super cute and i have not worn it yet so um yeah and then the shorts i'm gonna wear i have to wash them they're like a light wash and they're my, some of my favorite pair of shorts and then next i have this dress that i got also on this um spring break trip i believe i did get this um and this is from ross and i have not worn this yet either i've tried to wear this dress so many times I told you guys I tried to wear this for my birthday, I tried to take it to Myrtle Beach, and I have not worn it so many other times, and I'm, this is I've had this since April, and I have not worn it yet, so this is definitely a must that I'm bringing, and it's super cute, and I really want to wear it. Here, um, it's just an oversized tee, because, you know, one day I just want to be pretty comfortable, um especially if like we're not doing that much that day or i can always just use like a shirt as a cover-up and then i'm gonna pair it with these shorts you know just some little cotton shorts that are also like fitting that lounge like kind of vibe another like oversized tee and i am still gonna bring one um this one is from amazon i got this one for christmas and then the shirt and shorts over here the shirt is from goodwill and the shorts are from um by below. So I'm still gonna bring a oversized tee, but I'm also gonna bring like a tank top, another tank top, just in case I do wanna switch it up and not wear that. Or I could always wear it like underneath, whatever I wanna do. This one is from Sheen, it's super cute. I got this one for my birthday in my birthday haul. If you guys have not watched that video, you should definitely go watch it. I'll also link that video down in the description. We wear these shorts with that outfit. Um, these are some new jeans that I also got on the spring break trip. I did like a huge shopping spree if you guys don't remember that um, But these are also from Ross. These are super cute um, I don't have a wash like this and they fit really nicely So I really like those shorts as well on the way back like the fifth day on Wednesday I just brought like a little nice like black tee um, You know really simple and basic um, and this one is from Target and then I'm just gonna wear this like um, zip up that I have. I actually don't know where this one is from. Um, it was originally my mom's, but it's really cute. It says love on it when you zip it up. Um, and yeah, cause I don't wanna be too hot cause I'll still be there, but you know, I wanna be comfortable in the car. And then I'm just gonna wear these black leggings back. I always either bring like leggings or sweatpants on the way back either for on a plane or anything, you know, I just want to be super comfortable and warm um, because the car and planes can get really cold. But that's kind of like the overview. Obviously things can change, but since I won't have really that much time tomorrow, um, this will probably mostly stay the same. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and kind of like fold all this up um, and put it into my suitcase nice and neatly and then we'll get into the next episode. <laughs> This one is from Sheen. Um, I haven't worn this one in a hot minute, but these are the bottoms, and then the top is kind of like a tank top almost. Um, if we can get it untangled, but it's super cute and it's just like super like light, you know. Um, especially since right now I'm on my period and I don't know if I'm gonna be able to, you know, like get in the water and all that. 
So I want to make sure that I have something that's covering if I do even put on my bathing suit. And then I'm just going to bring this other one. This is one of my favorite ones also from Sheen. This one's a little bit more obviously um, showy and flashy. But um, when I take pictures at the beach, I like to bring like a nice cute bathing suit. And I haven't taken pictures in this one yet. Um, so yeah, that's the one I'm going to bring. And then for cover-ups, I always like to bring my like transparent like pants because these are super cute and they'll match with any bathing suit because they're white. But like if I don't want to put on like a top or put on like a full one, I like to just throw these on and they're also great for the pool as well. Um, and then I'm going to bring this one. Um, these are all from Sheen, like all these ones that I'm showing. And then I'm bringing this cover up. Um, this is from Sheen as well. I haven't worn this one yet. I got this one for my birthday, but it's just like kind of like a tank kind of like dress, I guess, if I would describe it like that. But it's super cute, and so I thought I'd bring this one this time. So, yeah. The suitcase is getting a little bit more filled, if you guys like want to see. Like, this is what it looks like. Um, yeah. We're just going to hope it closes, but this is the rest of the, like, um clothes I have to pack so I'm gonna try to fit my bathing suit and stuff in this area where I put my um undergarments so yeah okay so I just got like most of my like luggage pretty packed and it is very close to not closing but it's gonna close so don't worry about it finished packing my undergarments and pajamas and socks and all that boring stuff that nobody wants to see yeah that's what I just did so now we're actually going to get into the fun stuff so obviously this bag is not going to be big enough for the, like my skincare and makeup and all that jazz so we're going to have to use a different bag hold this bad boy this is my school backpack and this is what we're going to pack the rest of my stuff into because I think it's pretty easy, you know, I can carry this on my bag and then roll that, like, duh. Thursday, July 6th, and so um, I have all my laundry here from yesterday, and I'm just going to be going through it real quick to see what things and clothes that I want to pack or extra things that I need that I actually wash this stuff for. So I'm going to go through this really quickly and see what else I can find. <laughs> like the angle because I'm filming on my phone I don't really have a real camera um but sorry for the angle but anyways we made it into the bathroom and this is the last section that I have to pack for um so this is just gonna be like my bathroom essentials type of thing and I already like keep some of my stuff in here that really doesn't need to be taken out um but I have this new toothbrush so I'm gonna go ahead and like take it out of the packaging um and put it into like this toothbrush case that I have uh yeah, I got this actually on 4th of July. They like threw these at us. So I was like, hey, I have a new toothbrush. Anyway, so off track. But 
Now I'm just gonna get everything that I can into here because some things I can't get into here because I'm gonna have to be using them still throughout the week. So I'll put as much of as I can in here and I'll be back with you guys. All right guys, that leaves me to the end of today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Also, don't forget to watch my bonus video that came out on Wednesday. So make sure you guys go check that out. It's pretty short, but I still think you guys should definitely watch it and give that a thumbs up. As well as this video, make sure to Make sure to subscribe, comment, like, share, and make sure to turn on your bell notifications so you don't miss another video. And comment this emoji if you got to the end, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!